This build is sponsored by wood to works where you can get quality woods for your luthery, turning and carving needs. They ship worldwide and have a great service to help you choose through their great selection. Okay, so my stroke tuner is showing a B flat uh, plus 49 cents. That means I have 49 cents to be uh, removed to get uh, on pitch B flat. Uh, from there, what I'll do is uh, I'll check the response of the plate and depending how much response I get, I might go a bit lower, which means I would go all the way to an A. But I wanna, like my first target right here, cause I've never actually done a plate this big for the back. So I, I'm gonna do, uh, B flat for now and see how that goes. Something else I want to point out is the concert pitch being at 432. Uh, those of you that have been following my channel know uh, the reason behind it. Um, the, the usual concert pitch is 440. 432 was used back in the early days of Gibson when they were making those uh, F5 mandolins and that's why I'm using this pitch here. Now in order to tune the plate, uh, we want to get close to our target tuning as fast as possible. So I'm going to remove most of the wood in the thicker portion of the plate, which end up being in this section here. This is, and then there's the, the top portion here, as well as got a lot of material. So the more material I'm going to remove here, the faster the pitch is going to go down. And then to refine it, I'm going to go towards the surroundings. So that's going to uh, allow me to go a bit slower.
So we've got the back on the instrument and uh, it's been sanded uh, flush to the sides so uh, ready for binding but I'm going to wait uh, until I've tried the instrument to start the binding just in case I would have to uh, remove a part that makes it a lot easier. Um, so I did all the sanding uh, basically off camera but I was on a live feed so if you want to see that you can go check uh, the live feed that was posted about uh, shop hangout and the sanding on the bench. Um, so what's coming up next? Uh, we've got that little piece here to be added which is going to support the fretboard here and then uh, we've got the fretboard extender that I need to do and also the bridge and then when those three components are made and the fretboard is glued on uh, we'll be able to string it up and see how it sounds so uh, we're getting really really close uh, once the the sound test is done uh, we're going to be able to do the voicing and then uh, after that <clears throat> I'm going to get started on doing the binding and the finish finishing touches on this instrument but everything is going very well so far I'm really happy so I want to take a minute to thank uh, once again Bar River Wood Tool Works and you can see the address down here uh, for supplying the wood for this build uh, it's coming out amazingly I'm really happy on all the wood that have been selected for this build so thank you a big thank to you guys again so do check them out if you're uh, uh, searching for uh, quality woods uh, for wood turning uh, luthery or other projects that you may have down below you'll find some links uh, for my Instagram and my Facebook page uh, if you want to follow in between videos uh, there's a lot of pictures that get posted on both of them uh, there was an upgrade made onto my website, so go have a look. I do have uh, blog pages on it. Once again, I want to thank you all for taking the time for stopping by and watching this video. I really appreciate your time, and until next time, I wish you well.